Hi everyone, today I will be watching Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone. I was gonna watch something else today and then I noticed that I was really in the mood for fantasy, magic, sorcery and I don't have many recommendations in that style and I don't really know what why that is. So please let me know movies like Lord of the Rings, The Hobbit, stuff like that that is really good because I don't know why it happened. Maybe it's because I not watch it a lot that people don't recommend it a lot but I feel the need for it so please <laughs> let me know what I should watch to add to my list because I might watch a lot of those in this winter. Then I had an obvious answer in my mind for a long time which is the Harry Potter franchise. I struggle to watch this one on the channel because normally when I say that I've not watched a movie on this channel I can say hand on my chest that I've not watched it. I know that channels like mine sometimes get critiqued that people don't believe that but I'm like you know what I'm the only one who needs to live it myself. I know that what I say is true and I think that's super important as well. So that's why I'm giving this disclaimer. Normally everything that I say is first time watching it is but today it's not. So I watched them when I was really little and I feel the weird thing is about Harry Potter is that although you have not watched them for decades, you still remember the world, you still remember the feeling that it gave you, you still remember the school, the houses, uh, the stitch snitch <laughs> game. So in that sense I feel like I don't really know what the movies are about anymore. I would say maybe the first one a bit and maybe the fourth one a bit but that's it. I didn't know the franchise rather well and I think that if you have watched Harry Potter when you were younger you will totally get what I mean saying that you don't know what the movie's about anymore but you do know the people and the world that they live in. So yeah one thing that I do remember very well is in the fourth movie you had Cedric Diggory because I had a huge crush on him and that stuck with me and now I'm feeling very weird because then I was a young girl looking up to a slightly older boy I assume now I'm like a full-on adult woman and I think he might be in high school still. <laughs> so I feel like suddenly this might like completely turn around my worldview on Cedric Diggory because in my mind like I never grew up and he never grew up but yeah I grew up a lot so we'll see how that is gonna play out. But that's to say that that's why I do remember him being in the fourth movie and yeah I was thinking of maybe starting with the second one because there I can honestly say I don't know anything about it whatsoever anymore. But I feel like it's weird to start with a second movie in a franchise. I want to start with the first one. I do know that there's a stone and I'm gonna try to get it and Voldemort is a bad guy. So that's what I know from the first one and I think I want to have a lot of fun actually watching this franchise again and discovering everything that I've forgotten, remembering the storylines and Maybe deciding for once and for all if I'm more of a Ravenclaw or a Griff. No, not a Gryffindor. No, I'm a Ravenclaw or a Hufflepuff. Because that, yeah, slightly nerdier side, but then also the warm, emotional, caring personality. So I don't know which one I am. And I'm curious to know which one you are. So let me know in the comments down below. Hey, what Harry Potter house are y'all? I hope this disclaimer was very transparent. I do know the franchise and the world. I don't know the movies anymore, what happens in them. So I hope that's fine. Let's get into this reaction. If you like it, make sure to like and subscribe. And if you want to see the full reactions, you can find those on Patreon. There I post them every time. Let's get into this reaction. Damn, we can see like on the pixels that this movie has not been made yesterday but that's so cool because of course I was so little when I watched this so I had no idea back then it looked like <gasps> magic. Are the rumors true? Help us. I'm afraid so professor. I just realized that I've never watched this in English. So some of the names of course know in English from the internet and stuff but I don't know if McGonagall is one that I've known. <laughs> oh. There you go. Oh my god! I, they dropped him off with them. <sighs> okay, maybe I should not have been so worried about how much I remembered because I clearly <laughs> don't much. 
Oh man, it's actually really sad. Damn. There, there, Hagrid. It's not really goodbye after all. How long did he take care of him? Good luck, Harry Potter. Get up! Oh damn. Right, that piece of shit. Wake up, cousin! Dudley. I really need to write these names down. I've never heard them in English. Bring my coffee, boy. Yes, Uncle Vernon. Aren't they wonderful? <laughs> oh, okay. Spoiled. 36. Counted them myself. 36, but last year, last year I had 37. Oh, I would give you none every year, so it's the same every year. <laughs> I'm warning you now, boy. Any funny business, and you won't have any meals for a week. Hikes. Move. Move. He's asleep. How are Petunia and Vernon put off by his behavior? Like, come on, when he's like, ah! <laughs> and she's just like, <laughs> can you hear me? Mommy, Dad, come here! Can you believe what this thing is doing? Uh, whelp. Oh, goodbye, Snack. Any time. I should have rewatched this like the start I did this channel. Oh my god. I completely even forgot there was a part before school. Oh, I would get that smirk on my face. One minute the glass was there and then it was gone. It was like magic. There's no such thing as magic. <laughs> the denial stings, man. What an amazing score, by the way. <laughs> I'll be writing to you. The owls. <laughs> He's going, mother effer. <laughs> Get one, Harry. I think I would get like five just to be sure. She's not very talkative, is she? <laughs> oh, man. Like, as a child, when you watch this, you're like, oh, man, imagining a better world. But as an adult watching this, it's heartbreaking because he gets abused <laughs> and feels so alone and all. Oh. Are we here, Petunia? Sorry about that. <laughs> oh, yeah, because that must be so scary. Up, Dursley, you great <laughs> Baked it myself, words and all. <sighs> Isn't that a sweet? Happy birthday. Who are you? Rubius Hagrid. Of course, you'll know all about Hogwarts. Didn't the actor pass away very recently? Oh. You're a wizard, Harry. I'm a what? A wizard. Once you trade up a little. No. They're like, no, 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 no. You, that you have been accepted at Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. He will not be going to tell you. A great muggle like yourself's going to stop him, are you? Muggle? Non-magic folk. <laughs> Albus Dumbledore. I will not pay to have some crack. Archimentus is he in Dutch? <laughs> Never insult Albus Dumbledore. <laughs> wow, that was <laughs> more than deserved. <laughs> ah, I agree. Usual, I presume. Just helping young Harry here, boy. School supplies. Yes, my soul. It's Harry Potter. Welcome back, Mr. Potter. Damn, I feel like I remember so little that I'm like, why was he that important again? 
Potter, can't tell you how pleased I am to meet you. Harry, this is Professor Quirrell. Quirrell. Oh, I also had a crush on Snape because of the low voice. See, Harry, you're famous. But why am I famous, Hagrid? I don't remember, Harry. Tell us, Hagrid. Damn. Welcome, Harry. Diagon Alley. Diagon Alley. I'll have to get used to all these names. All the music. Bum, bum, bum. Oh, what a dream. This is exactly what I needed. <laughs> wow. If you were an adult when you saw this movie, how do you feel about it? Because I wonder, I have that nostalgic feeling, but what was it if you had no affiliation with Little Harry, you know? Mr. Harry Potter wishes to make a withdrawal. And does Mr. Harry Potter have his key? Ha! There is a little devil. Professor Dumbledore gave me this. It's about you know what in fault, you know which. Imagine if you had to do this every time you want to make a withdrawal or something. <laughs> Times before PayPal. Damn. <laughs> well, I'll need to talk to my parents. <laughs> Best not to mention this to anyone, Harry. Good kid. Imagine if it turns out that Harry is his tattletale and immediately tells it to everybody and they're like, what? <laughs> All the different settings. When I said magic fantasy, yeah, this is it. I wondered when I'd be seeing you, Mr. Potter. <laughs> Give it a wave. Oh, oh, oh. Good luck with your store. Goodbye. Oh, no. You could have used that at uh, the place where you grew up. <laughs> I guess we got the one. It is curious that you should be destined for this one when its brother gave you that scar. Okay, yeah, that's why he's so famous. Okay, yeah, yeah, because he survived the attack. <laughs> It's Hedwig in Dutch. I don't know if it's the same in English. Probably. Not all wizards are good. Some of them go bad. A few years ago, there was one wizard that went as bad as you can go. <gasps> Maybe she wrote it down. No, I can't spell it. Oh. Voldemort. Voldemort. Yikes. Except you. I have goosebumps. The boy who lived. That's why. Ooh. That must be so scary though, because it's like, does he want to kill me again? He killed my parents. He must be pissed off. Everybody knows me. I'm his failure, basically. There must be a mistake. This is platform nine and three quarters. He's 11 and you leave him behind. <laughs> Oh my god, baby Ron. <laughs> Fred, you next. He's not Fred, I am. Honestly, woman, you call yourself our mother. Oh, <laughs> Honestly, woman. <laughs> Damn. Damn, where is this filmed? It's funny to me because I do know it in Dutch, so... Now the British accents of all the actors are very apparent. Ron Weasley. I'm Harry. Harry Potter. Ron. Ron. Ron Weasley. Ron. Ron. <laughs> you know that song? <laughs> Anything off the trolley, dears? No, thanks. I'm all set. Oh, that looks gross. Bertie bought every flavour beans. They mean every flavour. He has a rat? No. No, not really. This one's not a rat. Has anyone seen a toad? Oh, she's so young. Oh, are you doing magic? Let's see then. Turn this stupid fat rat yellow. 
Well, it's not very good, is it? <laughs> oh, that bitch! <laughs> um, Ron Weasley. Pleasure. <laughs> that does sound better in British. Imagine this movie coming out and then on Monday all the kids need to bike to their boring schools. <laughs> Damn, look at that. Aren't there like trips that you can do to a castle like that where they reenact this whole vibe? You must be sorted into your houses. They are Gryffindor, Hufflepuff, Ravenclaw and Slytherin. <laughs> I'm an asshole. I'm gonna be in that one. <laughs> Harry Potter has come to Hogwarts. Harry Potter. This is Crab and Goyle and I'm Malfoy. Malfoy, Crab and Goyle. Some wizarding families are better than others, Potter. You don't want to go making friends with the wrong sort. Damn, kids are awful. I think I can tell the wrong sort for myself, thanks. <laughs> He's like, I lived with one of you guys. <laughs> I know enough. Oh my god, I've chills. You will come forth. I shall place the sorting hat on your head and you will be sorted into your houses. Hermione Granger? Mental, that one. I'm telling you. <laughs> oh, oh. She's pleased. Damn. It's cool to know if you think about it now, because Gryffindor is like for the brave ones, right? And all the Weasleys are in there. And if you would look at Ron right now, he's so dorky, you wouldn't immediately think that. Gryffindor. I love how the flaps of the hat go up. This is so interesting. What if they put him in Slytherin? What if he actually would end up there? Would there not be like a story somewhere where the story would be different? Let the feast begin. <laughs> oh, if only Christmas was that easy. How cool was it have been to record this? Did they actually get food? Or is it all like fake food? Or it looks real? Hello. How are you? Yeah, I completely forgot about the ghosts. <laughs> You're nearly headless Nick. I prefer Sir Nicholas if you don't. Whoa, that's rude. Like this. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh, so many pictures and like portraits. Can you imagine the look in Oma gonna go space if we were late? That was bloody brilliant. Oh, thank you for that assessment, Mr. Weasley. <laughs> There will be no foolish wand waving or silly incantations in this class. I can teach you how to bewitch the mind and ensnare the senses. He is cast amazing for his role, right? His voice. Turn this water into room. What's Seamus trying to do to that glass of water? I'm not very smart. That's so cool. Neville's got a remember all. When the smoke turns red, it means you've forgotten something. Oh boy. I can't remember what I've forgotten. <laughs> Imagine if it just read all day long and you're like... Believed to be the work of dark wizards or witches unknown, the vault in question, number 713, had in fact been emptied earlier that very same day. Harry, you can't talk about this. That's the vault Hagrid and I went to. No, 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 no. Oh, no. That's all to you. <laughs> she doesn't really take it well if somebody else is quicker. <laughs> the crew is like, no, no, no. Oh. <laughs> oh god, he's off. If you think about it, how is a teacher not prepared for this? Ah, oh, damn. Yikes. Ouch. Oh. <laughs> Epic jump from the teacher to the side. Oh, boy. Ah. Oh. Hooch. 
Everyone's to keep their feet firmly on the ground while I take Mr. Longbottom to the hospital wing. Maybe if the fat lump had given this a squeeze, he would remember to fall on his fat ass. <laughs> Give it here, Malfoy. Little douche. It's so sweet if you think about it that he's trying to save this gift. <laughs> Our little hero. Uh oh. Follow me. Damn, she got there quickly. Would I have found you a seeker? He's like, what? <laughs> Our job is to make sure that you don't get blooded up too bad. No one's died in years. Someone will vanish occasionally, but they'll turn Oops. up in a month or two. You won't make a fool of yourself. It's in your blood. I might need to the rescue. You never told me your father was a seeker too. Didn't know. Poor kid. Never even met his father. In a hallway like that, that's so tall. That was really creepy. Does anybody feel like we shouldn't be here? This is even more creepy. <laughs> this is the third floor. It's forbidden. Ah. Oh. Ilch. Oh, I had forgotten. <laughs> I really want to remember how I felt when I watched this as how old was I? Nine year old? <laughs> Seeing that. The ability to make objects fly. Uh, do you all have your feathers? Good. Ah. Uh, it's Liviosa, not Liviosa. <laughs> Wingardium Leviosa. Wingardium Leviosa. It's Leviosa, not Leviosa. Oh, rum biting the dust. How does he? How did he end up in this school? <laughs> oh, poor kid. No wonder she hasn't got any friends. I think she heard you. That was. Mean kids are tough. <laughs> there's so much candy, and there's one girl eating an apple. Fatty Patel said that she wouldn't come out of the girls' bathroom. Well, Ron. Thought you ought to know. Whoa, that sends a chill down your spine. What a nightmare if that's you. That's brave. Honestly, I wonder how many kids would actually try to face it. He did it! Look at him! Wrong! Okay! Gryffindor. Now that you've proven yourself against a troll, a little game of Quidditch should be easy work for you. Even if it is against Slytherin. <laughs> I'm guessing Snape let the troll in as a diversion so he could try and get past that three-headed dog. Now I don't remember if he actually had something to do with the dog. Oh, this is so cool. Is that allowed? What a dick move! Um, is he gonna be like the loser that can't handle it? Oh no, it's being um. He's jinxing the broom. Jinxing the broom. Oh yeah, if you think about it, everybody could just throw in some spells. It's all like, they're our face. Okay, thanks, Hermione. Let's go. Uh... Like 
All right. Yeah, assholes eat dirt. Why would Snake put a curse on Harry's brew? Why was he trying to get past that three-headed dog on Halloween? Who told you about Fluffy? <laughs> then I let him to Dumbledore to guard the... Yes? Shouldn't have said that. Oh. Snape's trying to steal it. God's wallop. What does God's wallop mean? Or is it a movie word? What that dog is guarding is strictly between Professor Dumbledore and Nicholas Flamel. <laughs> Nicholas Flamel? This guy. Hagrid, come on. <laughs> Are they the only two ones there? I've got presents. Yeah. Oh, that's so wholesome. Whoa. My body's gone. That's an invisibility cloak. Imagine living in this world where somebody could be under a cloak anywhere or it could be turned into a cat. And like, I could never look at a cat again and be like, are you a person? <laughs> Wow, isn't that heart wrenching? Oh man, this is so sad. Like I feel like I find this way more sad than when I was his age. I don't know. It shows us nothing more or less than the deepest and most desperate desires of our hearts. Don't you wonder what yours would show? Wow. Where was this actually filmed? Because probably in a castle? Here it is. Ooh, Elmick Elmick Castle. Is the only known maker of the Philosopher's Stone. The what? Which will make the drink for immortal. Immortal? It means you'll never die. That's why Voldy wants it. Okay. That's what Fluffy's guarding on the third floor. That's what's under the trap door. The Philosopher's Stone. Sorry, don't wish to be rude, but I'm in no fit state to entertain today. We know about the Philosopher's Stone. Stone. Oh. He was so polite. I mean, no fit state to entertain today. Can you imagine him just hanging out in that hut, having a nice day? Boy. So cute. Who's that? Malfoy. Oh God, of course. Good evening. Oh, don't you just hate him? <laughs> Wait, but he was out too, though. All four of you will receive detention. Oh. <laughs> you see, honourable as your intentions were, you two were out of bed. Honourable. Oh, justice. She must be like, a <laughs> little shit. <laughs> Ooh, damn, like I'm really impressed with how much there is in one movie. Like this is not a slow movie if you think about it. They go from one situation to the other. Uh, you. Ah, curse. Uh, why are we not running, Harry? Damn. The forest is not safe at this time. What was that thing you saved me from? What are you? <laughs> Do you know what is hidden in the school at this very moment, Mr. Potter? The Philosopher's Stone. He's just telling everybody. Imagine if he didn't know this person, horse. He said the trick with any beast is to know how to calm him. Take Fluffy, for example. Just play him a bit of music and he falls straight to sleep. It's like... <laughs> Do you want my credit card code? Here, I'll just give it to you. <laughs> well, not impressed, I guess. You're sneaking out again, aren't you? Oh God, what are you gonna do? You'll get Gryffindor into trouble again. I I I'll fight you. Oh boy. <laughs> wow. That Ooh, that's next level. <laughs> <laughs> already asleep. Snape's already been here. He's got horrible breath. I'm still impressed by the fact that she saw that he was standing on something. If something bad happens, on the get yourselves out. Jump! 
Wow, that was so close. Oh, this one I do remember. You need to keep calm to fall through. Which is like, don't think about white polar bears. And what do you do? This is Devil's Snare. You have to relax. <gasps> I'm so relaxed. He's not relaxing, is he? Apparently not. Time this lady. Whew. Lucky we didn't panic. <laughs> They're keys, and I'll bet one of them fits that door. Oh, oh. trying to get it. If Snape can catch it on that old broomstick, you can. I'm really imagining Snape on that broomstick right now. <laughs> Like it was nothing. Look at you. Oh, oh. that's quite aggressive. Ooh. It's just bored. That is so cool. Wait, so we had a dog, the herbs, the keys, and a chessboard. The chessboard is easily the very coolest, right? He's confident. Oof! Damn, that's epic. Take care of Ron. Then go to the Owlery. Send a message to Dumbledore. You're a great wizard. You really are. Is there a... And Harry. Just be careful. Look at that. How sweet. Mm. Kind of really want to know more about the making of this movie. Like the place where it was filled. Like I have a castle now. And other skin. Like oh my god I want to. Mm. No. It can't be. Snape. He... Next to him. Who would suspect? Stuttering Professor Quirrell. Snape tried to kill me. Mm, no, dear boy. I tried to kill you. <laughs> Even with Snape muttering his little counter curse. Snape was trying to save me. What? Him. Okay. Then, then, then you let the troll in. Very good, Potter. Yes. Would you look at that? I see myself holding the stone. But how do I get it? Use the boy. Uh, excuse me. No way! What a nightmare. See what I must do to survive. He has more heads than Nicholas. <laughs> Something that conveniently enough lies in your pocket. How does he know? Why suffer an horrific death when you can join me and live? Damn, dude, you killed his parents. What do you expect? Would you like to see your mother and father again? Oh, nee, don't believe him. He cannot bring them back. How did he get it in his pocket? I'm so confused. Okay. Becoming a wizard and then and I'm strangling a child. Uh, okay. Damn, like. <laughs> uh oh. It's not over, is it? Good afternoon, Harry. Tokens. Of your admirers? What happened to down in the dungeon is a complete secret. <laughs> the whole school knows. <laughs> I love how Dumbledore is aware of how gossip works. 
The stone has been destroyed. That flew out. He'll die, won't he? How is it I got the stone, sir? In a way, I'm also like, can't imagine that after 600 years, you're not done living. Only a person. Everybody that you know has passed away 500 years earlier. Would not use it. Would be able to get it. Interesting. Slytherin House. Yeah! Recent events must be taken into account. <laughs> Last minute point. <laughs> That's such a dick move from Dumbledore if you think about it. 50 points. 50 points. 60 points. 10 points. This is unfair. I know. Oh, that warms my heart. <laughs> Enough for <laughs> Ravenclaw and Hufflepuff are also just really happy. <laughs> Train's leaving. Go on, go on. Come on, hurry up. He has to go back to home to these awful people. Oh, my heart. I feel like Kid Mary thought, like, oh, this movie is super cool and all the magic. And Adult Mary is like, this is actually so emotional, too. So sad, but sometimes heartwarming. I am so happy that I watched this. And I also have to say that I'm actually a bit upset at myself that I waited so long to do this. Because this was exactly what I needed today. I wanted that fantasy, magic, wizards all of that and i remember it way less from this movie than i anticipated when i started i was like okay damn the philosopher's stone i'm gonna know too much about this to enjoy it but oh my god i missed so many parts and i'm excited because if this is how i feel at the first one i didn't even have a clue what the second one was about third one not either fourth one i know the house schools but then i'm gonna look up now how many are uh after the fourth one because that's been such a long time ago and yeah i feel a philosopher's stone was my best recollection so i kind of want to watch the next one immediately that was what i needed i'm so happy <sighs> sometimes it's yeah i feel like with this channel i learned to love movies from a first time watching without a nostalgic feeling that i had with this one but honestly i have to say that watching this one it warms my heart so much and I noticed a lot of different things than were in my memory, like how sad it was that he lost his parents and stuff and how lonely that must be. I don't know if I felt that when I was younger, that was more overwhelmed with the magic. Well, now I'm, yeah, way more into emotional story too. <sighs> Let me know what you thought about this movie when you watched it the first time and also what age were you? Because I feel like I was right at the age where Harry Potter grew up. I was nine when this one came out. So I must have been a lot younger. Wait, but he got his letter when he was 11. And when did the books came out? When I was like seven or eight or something? Was I so little? Yeah, that's crazy if you think about it. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this reaction. Let me know what house you think you're in. I'm going to read these comments. I want to know what house you are and why you think you are that house. And if you want to... I, I'm so bad at these end, end talks. Like and subscribe. All reactions are on Patreon. I'll see you in the next one. Have a lovely rest of your day. Bye.